Hello, I'm Mike Traskos, president of Lectromech, and this video today we will be looking into an electrical arcing event, a UV filtered high speed review of wire failure. The damage caused by wire failure due to direct electrical arcing is well documented. Testing performed by Lectromech has shown the impact of electrical arcing to nearby systems. The objective of the testing shown here was to examine the arc plume generated by wire failure. Although Electromech has done thousands of arc damage assessment tests, this was the first time we had access to a UV filtered high speed camera. The test harness used in this video was a 7 wire 8 gauge configuration. The configuration of the power is similar to that of AS4373 wet arc track resistance test though in that test a 20 gauge wire is typically used. The figure on the right shows the power configuration of this harness with all three phases of AC115 power being used. The harness was prepared in such a way that once the power was placed onto the sample electrical arcing would initiate. Above this arcing harness was a half inch outer diameter aluminum tube and this was placed above the wire harness. The separation distance between the arcing wire harness and this tube was one inch. This is the high speed video of the arc. As you can see the arc is a very sporadic event that emanates from the wires and goes out in various directions from the, the wire harness. One item to note here is that the arc plume regularly envelops the tube. In conclusion, we can see that the hot ionized gas from the electrical arcing can span more than an inch of the separation distance. Electromech has the capabilities to help your organization define the safe separation distances from wiring systems. To find out more about these services or about Electromech, visit us at electromech.com. Thank you for your attention.